Lanzhou is the capital city of Gansu Province, as well as the political, cultural, economic, and technological center. As the second largest city in northwestern China, it possesses a long history and a rich culture. The center of the city is surrounded by mountains on the northern and southern side. Yellow River passes across it on the eastern and western side. Over 100 miles winding through the city, Lanzhou is the only provincial city across which Yellow River goes in the downtown area. Moreover, adjacent to the mountains and rivers, static mountains and flowing waters from the unique and fascinating landscape embraced by the mountains and the water. Lanzhou Jiao Tong University is endowed with the opportunity to be a neighbor of Yellow River. Established in 1958, Lanzhou Jiao Tong University was composed of partial disciplines in Tangshan Railway Institute, now known as Southwest Jiao Tong University, and the Beijing Railway Institute, now known as Beijing Jiao Tong University, at the beginning. Then it moved to Lanzhou, originally named Lanzhou Railway College. As the third railway institute in China, it is a high-level teaching and research university that focuses on engineering specialties and coordinated development of multiple subjects. Lanzhou Jiao Tong University has formed certain competitiveness and uniqueness in the disciplines as transportation engineering, civil engineering, environmental science and engineering, mechanical engineering, management science and engineering, control science and engineering, information and communication engineering, computer science and technology, mathematics and so on. In particular, bridge and tunnel engineering, transportation information engineering and control, transportation planning and management, vehicle engineering and other disciplines demonstrate great strength among the Chinese universities. With regard to wind and solar energy, green vacuum coating, anti-dust technology, green eco-pesticides, dyeing art and many other fields, a batch of core technological and competitive industries have been formed. The School of Traffic and Transportation has two first-level doctoral disciplines, one postdoctoral research station, five postgraduate stations, and four undergraduate majors as traffic and transportation, transportation engineering, logistics management, information management, and information system, among which traffic and transportation is a national distinctive major. Moreover, there are three learning and research and development centers, Dangerous Goods Consultation and Evaluation Center for Ministry of Railway, Bulk Goods Loading Reinforcement Technology Consultation Center for Ministry of Railway, and Packaging Industrial Technology Center for Gansu Province. The School of Automation and Electric Engineering actively adapts to the demands on talents for railway construction. It strengthens the construction of distinctive railway majors and sets up the majors such as Urban Railway Transportation Signals, Locomotive and Vehicle Control Technology, Overhead Line System Engineering, Urban Railway Transportation Power Supply Technology, centering on high-speed, heavy loading and safety, focusing on supporting distinctive researches and teams, relying on the photoelectric technology and intelligent control key laboratory of Ministry of Education and China National Green Coating Technology and Equipment Engineering Technology Research Center. The school actively conducts the scientific researches on whole electronic 
microcomputer, interlocking in railway, train operation control, motor vehicle control, industrial automation, wide energy generation control technology, railway power supply system, electric attraction and automation. The School of Electromechanical Engineering has seven undergraduate majors such as Mechanical Design, Manufacturing and Automation, Vehicle Engineering, Thermal Energy and Dynamics Engineering, Measurement Control and Instrument, two doctoral stations as Vehicle Engineering and Loading Transportation Tool Application, ten postgraduate stations as Mechanical Electronic Engineering, Detection Technology and Automation Equipment, Vehicle Engineering, Mechanical Manufacturing and Automation, Test Measurement Technology and Device, Thermal Engineering. Moreover, the school has one provincial key discipline as Mechanical Engineering, the National Structural Strength Test Center, the University Experimental Teaching Demonstration Center of Gansu Province, the Logistics and Transportation Equipment Information Engineering Center of Gansu Province, two Youth Technological Innovation Demonstration Bases of Gansu Province, and other nine specific research institutes. School of Civil Engineering now possesses five undergraduate majors, respectively Civil Engineering, Engineering Management, Water Conservancy and Hydropower Project, Engineering Cost and Engineering Mechanics. In particular, Civil Engineering is a unique national major that is also State Engineering Lab for Road and Bridge Disaster Prevention, Major Structural Engineering Lab in Ministry of Railway, Major Road and Bridge and Underground Engineering Lab in Gansu Province, National Experimental Teaching Demonstration Center of Civil Engineering, Chong Kong Scholar Innovation Team for Material and Structural Durability in Arid Zones in Ministry of Education. Now, there is first-level civil engineering discipline, first-level traffic and transportation engineering, doctoral disciplines, and postdoctoral research stations. There are eight secondary disciplines, doctor degree authorized stations, including bridge and tunnel engineering and geotechnical engineering, 16 postgraduate degree authorization stations, 3 engineering postgraduate authorization stations, and Master of Engineering Management MEM, authorization stations. Over 30 research achievements have obtained national and provincial rewards. Peculiarly, Qinghai Tibet Railway obtained special award for national technological progress. Computer Science and Technology in School of Electronics and Information Engineering is also a major provincial subject in Gansu as the first level postgraduate discipline authorization station. It possesses National Computer Experimental Teaching Sample Center, National Experimental Zone of Transportation Information Talent Cultivation Mode. There are four departments now, respectively, Department of Telecommunication Engineering, Department of Computer Science and Technology, Department of Electronics Science and Technology, and Department of Electronic Information Engineering, two National Experimental Teaching Sample Centers, respectively, Electronic and Electrical Experimental Center and Computer Science and Technology Experimental Teaching Center, National Basic Computer Software Technology Courses Team, and a National Experimental Zone of Traffic Information Innovative Talent Cultivation Mode. Additionally, Telecommunication and Automation Railway Lab, Major Plateau Traffic Information Engineering and Control Lab in Gansu Province, Network Test Technology Research Center in Gansu Province, Network Monitoring Center in Gansu Province, 
and other major labs, as well as computer application technology and postgraduate demonstration base, cooperated with Gansu Electricity Information and Telecommunication Center. School of Environment and Municipal Engineering sets up four majors for undergraduates and possesses eight postgraduate degree authorized stations, first level environment science and engineering disciplines, and the right to grant doctoral degrees of secondary subjects, such as municipal engineering, ventilation for heating and burning, and air conditioner engineering. In addition, in 2009, it set up first-level environment science and engineering discipline, secondary postdoctoral research stations for municipal engineering, ventilation for heat and burning, and air conditioner engineering. There are also two research platforms in Ministry of Education, i.e., comprehensive utilization of water resource in cold and dry areas, engineering research center and Chang Kong Scholar and Innovative Team Development Plan, as well as four provincial research and teaching platforms, i.e. Major Environment Engineering Test Center Lab and Ministry of Railway, Turning Sewage into Resource Technology Research Center in Gansu Province, Experimental Teaching Demonstration Center of Environment Science and Technology Experimental in Gansu Province and Dust Processing in Storage Transportation Research Center in Gansu School of International Education in Lanzhou Jiao Tong University takes charge of enrollment and management of overseas students as well as Chinese teaching, research the school have two functional offices, i.e., Office of Teaching Affairs and Overseas Student Management, which respectively take charge of enrollment, management, and teaching related to foreign students. Additionally, School of International Education has one dormitory building and four specific classrooms for overseas students two multimedia classrooms and two language classrooms. Lanzhou Jiao Tong University provides sound living conditions for overseas students. There are several Muslim canteens for students from Muslim nations. Besides, the canteens and a small agricultural product market are within three minutes walking. Inside overseas students' dorm, there are kitchen facilities so that they can make dishes themselves according to their own preferences. Closed-circuit television terminal, network wire terminal, independent restroom and hot water shower are all equipped to provide convenience for students as much as possible. Foreign students study and live in a relaxing and happy atmosphere in the university. We also set up cultural courses and practical classes for foreign students. Besides teaching Chinese and Chinese culture in class, the students are encouraged to go out of classrooms to pay visits to museums, historical sites, so that they can better feel Chinese culture personally. A diversity of after-class activities are also organized for international students. We often hold campus-level basketball competition, volleyball competition, and other sports competition, writing contest, speech contest, and other knowledge-related contests, so that overseas students can integrate into the splendid campus life. Various entertainment activities are also held, such as International Cultural Festival, for overseas students and overseas students in China. By organizing the activities, the students can immerse in learning and enjoy learning with great fun. With convenient transportation, intensive learning atmosphere, and high-quality faculty teams, we are looking forward to your coming.